Miss Threadgood's things. What are you doing in here? Where is Miss Threadgood? Who? Mrs. Threadgood, the woman who lives here. Are you deaf? I'm sorry, miss. All they told me was that the woman who lived in here died this morning. Oh, my God. What? What are you saying? Well, she's down. That's all I know. room ready for another patient. Well, she may be just another patient to you, but she was my friend. I loved her. Sorry. I'm just following orders. What is going on here? Why um, didn't you call me? You could have at least called me before I'm you said that. Sorry, Miss Couch. It just never occurred to me that you would take it this hard. I didn't even get to tell her goodbye. Oh, no, these things are difficult, but she died peacefully in her sleep. Now, to tell you the truth, I thought you'd be happy for Miss Threadgood. Happy? Like, yes, this is what she wanted. What, to be dead? No, to go home. You just missed her. She left her in a yellow cab about a half hour ago. I don't understand. What, a cab? Well, yeah, she said there wasn't no reason for her to stay now that Miss Otis had died. Mrs. Otis is dead? <laughs> well, Mrs. Otis. Oh, God, I've got to stop her. 